from violently assaulting police to threatening to kill them during arrest, some rappers show no remorse when it comes to breaking the law. One of the hoodlums who has no regret for his actions is Polo G. What you probably don't know is that Polo G has a dark and lengthy criminal past that is straight up disturbing. He might have gotten away with attacking cops in the past, but this time he may have finally gone too far and could be sent to prison forever. Keep watching till the end of this video to see why Polo G was really arrested. Trust me, you don't want to miss this. Why Polo G was arrested Polo G acts like he's chasing the world's record for most arrests for shocking crimes. Just within the span of 24 hours, the rapper was arrested and booked by two different police departments. On August 23rd, Polo G and his younger brother Trench Baby were put in cuffs and hauled off to jail due to an incident that occurred at the rapper's residence. Police showed up at Polo G's home to arrest his younger brother on charges of robbery, but Polo was caught up in the crossfire. According to the LAPD, the rapper was arrested alongside his brother and charged with illegal possession of a short-barreled rifle. Seven other firearms were found in the rapper's home. The raid which led to the arrest of the rapper was due to a report that came in on Trench Baby on August 15. According to the report, Trench Baby had robbed a man in the Granada Hills neighborhood of Los Angeles during a music video shoot. The alleged victim of the incident was Trench Baby's own videographer. He reported to police that when Trench Baby arrived at the video shoot, things took a dangerous turn. Apparently, Trench Baby approached the victim and pressed a handgun with an extended magazine against his body, demanding money. The videographer was even forced to transfer funds to Trench Baby out of his bank account. According to police, Trench Baby and the alleged victim had a good working relationship in the past, making the crime even more inexplicable. The police also reported that a small bag of unknown drugs was found on Trench Baby's body at the time of his arrest during a pre-booking search. Polo G's lawyer provided a statement regarding the rapper's alleged crimes, saying the incident surrounded someone staying at Polo's home and not Polo directly. He further explained, the officers detained Polo to verify that he is not a convicted felon as they assert a firearm was found in the home. It is widely known that Polo is not a convicted felon. Then, in a wild turn of events, Polo G and Trench Baby were charged by yet another police department with kidnapping, robbery, and assault with a deadly weapon shortly after the arrest by the LAPD. These new charges were brought by the Burbank Police Department based on an incident report against the brothers that was filed in April 2023. Both Polo G and Trench Baby were later released on a $100,000 bond, but they are to appear in court on October 26, 2023. The brothers' charges with the LAPD are still intact and they are pending review in the Los Angeles County District Attorney's Office. Polo G's attorney, Bradford Cohn, gave another statement about his client saying, Regarding Burbank, we are awaiting additional information. Cohn also added, Given that the charges against Polo are very unusual given the timing and purported knowledge of the police, the length of time between the alleged incident and the arrest is suspect. We believe once all the facts come out, it will be a very different picture than how the charges look on paper. Cohn ended the statement with a reassurance about his client's innocence, which read, We look forward to challenging the accusations and the vindication of our client. Polo G, born Taurus Bartlett, and his brother Trench Baby, born Toreen Bartlett, are currently out on bond. The brother's mother, Stacy Mack, wrote on her Instagram story, Polo and T-Baby have been released. She added, thank you for your concern and prayers. Polo G's dark and lengthy arrest record. Polo G may not be the one intentionally making trouble in his recent arrest, but the rapper is known to be a menace on a regular basis. He's always caught up in one drama or another with the police. In 2021, Polo G was arrested due to an incident that occurred some hours after he hosted a release party for his album, Hall of Fame. The rapper had gotten out of line when he lashed out at a police officer. According to the Miami-Dade County Corrections and Rehabilitation, Polo G was charged with battery on a police officer, threats to a public servant, criminal mischief, resisting an officer with violence to his person, and resisting an officer without violence to his person. 
Reports stated that the rapper was initially stopped for a traffic infraction, but Polo escalated the situation when he resisted arrest and fought with the police officer before he was pinned to the ground and handcuffed. While the rapper was in the back seat of the police vehicle after his arrest, it was alleged that he repeatedly kicked the car doors and window bars. He also destroyed the electronic device used to operate one of the officer's windows. Police also reported that the rapper used threatening language against an officer. Bolo G's words were, I will kill you, I swear I will use these fists to beat the shit out of you and knock your ass out. Bolo G's mother, who also happens to be his manager, came out in support of her son's actions as she went on social media to defend him, saying he was an innocent passenger in the vehicle the police had stopped. The rapper's mother wrote on Twitter in response to a tweet, None of these charges would have been possible if the police did not make contact with my son Polo G. He was not the driver. She added that her son was just a passenger in a professionally licensed vehicle with security, which meant he hadn't committed any crime. Polo G was booked into jail on five charges, but he was released on bond some hours later. The rapper immediately tweeted, they playing foul in Miami, a short while after his release. Some of Polo G's charges were later dropped after a spokesman for the Miami-Dade State Attorney's Office confirmed that he had enrolled in a pre-trial diversion program and completed the program successfully. The rapper's two felonies, which included battering a police officer and threatening a public servant, coupled with the charge of misdemeanor criminal mischief, still kept him in the police black book. Polo G's wild beef with other rappers Polo G has had his fair share of beefs with other rappers in the industry since he became famous. One of the rapper's most notorious beefs was the time he treated Gunna like he didn't even exist. Polo G and Gunna's beef came out when it was assumed on the No Jumper podcast that Polo had joined the long list of rappers who unfollowed Gunna. Rappers like Lil Baby and Meek Mill reportedly unfollowed Gunna on social media due to the alleged snitch title given the rapper after he took a plea deal in his YSL Rico case. However, Polo responded to the accusation and his response was even more insulting than what people had expected. The rapper said the reports about him unfollowing Gunna on social media were false as he had never even followed Gunna at all. Polo wrote, I wasn't never following him to unfollow him. Y'all be on my d He also included, I don't follow up behind nobody. I make my own decisions as a man, and I do a good job at minding my business. You don't see me in shit for a reason. I don't f with d good or bad, simple and plain. This came as a big blow to Gunna's fans, as both Polo and Gunna had collaborated on a few projects together in the past, which were well received by their respective fans.